Hey guys, Tanner69046 here, and I'm back with a new series, um, Euro Truck Simulator 2, and I'm just gonna do some short driving to, from place to place in this series. It's modded, of course, as you can tell. Um, today we're hauling um, some logs from Banska Bristica 2. Well, probably somewhere near Lodes <laughs> or Lodge. We're not gonna go all the way. That's pretty long. Do it off camera or just do another episode. I don't know um, because yeah, it's, that'd be a long episode. I'm just gonna talk for about 30 minutes or so and then end it. So yeah, but I'm uh we're in the Kenworth W900. We're using a manual transmission with an H shifter. Um, using the Logitech G27. I don't have a face cam because I didn't feel like it. It's a beautiful trailer. Um, uh, yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and get them, uh, we're gonna go get trucking, I guess. Let's put it in first, and now we're off. That's not first. <laughs> there we go. So, sorry if you can hear me shifting in this video, but it's, um, uh, I have to, I guess. I don't have to, but it makes the game more enjoyable to do your own gear shifting. California stop sign. <laughs> if you don't know what a California stop sign, it's basically when you stop, <laughs> but you don't. So you you sort of stop, but then you just roll on through. So yeah, uh, we're gonna try, yeah, we were gonna follow the speed limit, I was gonna say we're gonna try and follow the speed limit here, but 19 miles an hour is a little ridiculous to be following. <laughs> Alright, so we're making a turn right here. I love how I checked when it was way too late to be checking. Um, so there's a few topics I want to talk about for today. Um... Of course, this is going up on my main channel, Tanner69046. Uh, I wanted to talk about in Mississippi at Ole Miss. They took down the Confederate flag. And that's kind of expected. Um, I'm okay with this. You've probably <laughs> seen that I'm, uh, I've kind of argued that the Confederate flag shouldn't be banned. But what the heck is this? Is there a train coming? No? Okay. <laughs> That's completely legal what I just did there, by the way, guys. So don't question it. <laughs> um, but yeah, they... They took down the Confederate flag at the main campus, I think it was. Or it might have been... I don't even know. But yeah, they took it down. Um, I'm not going to argue if it should have been taken down. What I would have voted for. Gosh, stay on the road, Tanner. Focus as you talk about this topic. Um, I'm not going to argue over should it have been... Would I have kept it up? Would I have voted to take it down? But what I'm going to talk about is basically it, that's democracy for you. They said, hey, we all voted to take it down. The flag's coming down. <laughs> and that's how democracy works. I'm not going to talk about how ironic it is considering they're the Ole Miss rebels. <laughs> or if it should have stayed up, if they should have made a change. Or I don't know. Um, I'm interested if they're going to change the Ole Miss or Mississippi st just flag in general, the state flag. Because the state flag has the Confederate, well not the Confederate flag, but the rebel flag in the top left hand corner. Kind of like how we have the 50 stars, well they have a Confederate flag right there. Um, so that's that. Um, so that's in the corner, and I don't know if they're going to take that down, but like I said, um, a lot of people are like, no, you shouldn't take it down, no, I can't believe they're going to take it down, that's so against my freedom of speech. Well, they're not banning the flag from you. The only thing they're doing to you is essentially taking it down from the campus because the majority voted for it, which is how a democracy functions. Way to turn off your brights late, dude. Thanks a lot for that. Oh my god. Curve almighty here. Um, recording this on a Monday, 
I'm not at school. I have pink eye. I can't tell if he's, if I'm stuffed up or not, but yeah, I'm a little sick. I decided, you know what, I'm... Alright, so basically, if I lay in bed, I feel like crap. If I get up, I feel like crap. If I run around, I feel like crap. I feel the same level of crap no matter what exercise I do, so I was like, you know what? Why not be productive and get a video out? An odd video at that, because I'm actually doing Euro Truck Simulator 2 with an American truck. USA, USA, USA. Don't crash it now. That's, that's a loaded democracy right there. Woo. I can't even woo because of my voice. <laughs> that's okay. Holy crap. That was a thing of beauty right there. Um, look ahead. Did we just pass a gas station? I needed gas. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> that's never good. Ah! Hey there, trucker. Um, I needed gas. Okay, so we're... We're gonna... Shift down. Listen to that Jake break. Holy cow, these roads! Where the heck are we? <laughs> In Europe? Duh, but holy crap. We're just gonna roll on down the hill here. Gently. <laughs> we got any damage to the trailer? No. I need to repair the truck. So yeah, um, I'm recording this video. Um, tell me if y'all like this content. Might get new subscribers from this. I don't know. That'd be cool if we did. Oh my god! Oh man, what a curve! That was a heck of a curve there. Alright, we're just gonna cut the corners on some of these. Because there's no oncoming. Oh my gosh. Alright, get over on the far right hand side. Watching my mirrors, watching my mirrors. I'm sorry, car! I can't do anything about it. I'm as far over as I can get without hitting the rail, dude. You gotta give me space. <laughs> I'm hauling like a 52 foot trailer over here and you're gonna try and get in my way. <laughs> That's not how it works. <laughs> well, I mean, it is, because I should have stayed on my own side of the road, but I couldn't. <laughs> Did you see that curve? <laughs> we getting any damage? Yeah, I'm suing. <laughs> Even though it was my fault. Oh man. That was an intense curve there. But yeah, um. Sorry, my voice is kind of. Bleh. Sorry if my mic is kind of bleh. I'm getting a new one for my birthday. Uh oh, my cord fell down. I need to tape that. I'm getting some cable management for my birthday too. Ooh ah. Okay, stay on the road. <laughs> I don't have um a force feedback, so this is different for me. We'll, we'll set the cruise control here so I can relax my feet. Um, we're gonna be on the lookout for any gas stations, obviously. <laughs> We're only almost bottomed out on the tank. Um, I've got most of this on higher ultra graphics. The mirrors are set to medium and I just turned off the grass. Because for one, if there's a bunch of tall grass everywhere, the highway patrol is doing a complete crappy job of keeping the roads clear. <laughs> and it does cause a bit of lag. I'm getting a strong 60 FPS, which is what this video will be uploaded in. I'm neat over, dude. You gonna let me? Thanks, dude. You're awesome. Uh oh, wrong button. I mean, wrong, wrong pedal. Blinkers are nice to use, dude, if you want to. So, thank you. Nope, nope, you didn't use a blinker. You're just gonna dive over. That's okay. See how I used a indicator jerk? Oh, I'm going in the grass a little bit. <laughs> I probably could have done it, but I'm recording and I'm distracted. So yeah, I'm, uh, what else I was going to talk about is I might make a movie. This is for all you Minecraft watchers. I'm sure that 95% of you watching this video... I'd say 99% of you watching this video watch Tornado Survival on my channel. Um, <laughs> and I'm sure a good at least 50% of you had seen Season 1 of Tornado Survival and know who Lucy is, know what she did, know what I did, blah blah blah. Yeah, you know the character Lucy in season one. 
I'm thinking of making a movie biased towards biased around the story of Lucy. Basically, we already know the story of her. Um, we know the story of her in Cabin Kingdom. We know the story of her, and I'm uh in season one, and we know where she is right now in season five. We, I'm going to cover the story. The movie would be about before Cabin Kingdom. How did she get to Cabin Kingdom? Where was she before Cabin Kingdom? How did I find Lucy? All that's uh, adding a whole new prequel kind of story there. The movie would recreate scenes from Cabin Kingdom. Probably recreate the tornado that brought us to season one. It would probably recreate parts of season one, all the intense parts. And then it would cover how Lucy got to season five world, and then it would cover the end of season five tornado survival, and of course, I'll overturn in here, the end of the movie. So yeah, that would be a good movie idea I'm thinking about doing. So we're just gonna come in for a stop here. Wow, this light looks really crappy. So yeah, let's just get a better look at the red gear as we fill her up. Oh yeah, look, a confederate flag right there. <laughs> as we were talking about that earlier. Wow, the lighting makes this rig look like crap. Alright, so. Been recording for about 12 minutes. Might go a little bit longer here. Yeah? As you can see, I'm definitely not going to... Go, 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 go. Put the pedal to the metal. Definitely not going to finish out this journey as we have 539 more miles to go. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not happening. So, yeah, as for the movie idea, it could happen. It might not happen. It's just a great idea that I had. It'd be a lot of work and effort I'd have to put into that if I wanted to make that a movie. So, we'd would... I would think about it so let's go with that answer there so yeah there's that topic are you serious another toll screw you shift down let's just listen to this This is hey. Oh, it's blocked. Hey, I've got my reverse lights on, people. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me, dude. I gotta get over. Thanks. <laughs> Tanner paying attention while driving. So, yeah. Um, I'm also supposed to be studying for my driver's test. Or not my driver's test, my driver's permit right now because I'm turning. I turned 16 on October 27th. This will probably go up on like Thursday or something. Because I've already got an episode of Tornado Survival that I'm going to release on the 27th that you all probably already watched. With no tornadoes in it, I need to fix that. But we did finish the tree farm. It's a very successful episode. Uh, yeah. I needed to miss school. I was just, I felt like crap this morning, so I didn't go. It's, I don't know, I hate missing school because there's that makeup work that you have to do and it's just, oh, why? <laughs> Alright, looks like we're turning up here. Alright. Alright, let's see. Hopefully this video turns out okay. It's my first time recording like a video based on Euro Truck Simulator to the series. I did a channel update regarding Tornado Wars and Euro Truck Simulator. Let's see, nothing. Oh no no no! I'm sorry, dude. I didn't see your blinker. I'm a great driver. I will be a great driver. <laughs> 
Sorry. Sorry, I'm Canadian. Canadian truck simulator. Hey. Alright, so. Probably 500 miles to go. I'll just end off this video. We're 15 minutes in, or roughly 15 minutes in. Wow, we just hit a town. Where are we? Catawice. Oh, we're next to Krakow. That's cool. Um, I'm really hyped for your uh, American Truck Simulator, which will come out in 2016. That series, I will do a series on that. That is going to be hype. Um, the reason I'm doing this video, or videos like this, is because it's not coming out till 2016. They said it was going to come out in, like, this month, or next month. My bad, yeah, next month. So, there's that. New. Oh, yeah. See, stuff like this, driving this around with other trucks. Get back in their lane. There we go. <laughs> not paying attention. Ah! Really not paying attention. Alright, yep. Refocus. Alright, we'll just get going about 75 and then set on the cruise control. There. Set it right there on 75. Well, I don't know if we should go 75, but we are. <laughs> Now we're gonna crash. We're gonna back it back down to 70. We're not Smokey and the Bandit over here. We ain't gotta get there as soon as we can. We, we're just cruising along for the video. But yeah, um, I've got a video coming out today. I'll have, what, two videos out next week? Maybe less. Maybe more. And then I don't know how many I'll have the week after. That, that's just whatevs. Um, there will be a hopefully a consistent amount of videos going up throughout November and December and some into January because I get election day a break like a two day weekend there where I don't have to do anything I get Thanksgiving break where I don't have to do anything I get Christmas break where I don't have to do anything that's like two weeks of nothing so yeah and then Martin Luther King Jr. Day we all get off for that so I don't know there's there's time for me to record between now and through January, so hopefully the school year will fly by and it'll be summer before we know it and I can upload on a daily basis again, yay. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just going to see how this series goes. It's good. I don't have to do update videos when I can just drive and be like, hey, I'm updating you right now. You feel updated? Because you should. Right now, the only two series for sure would be this. Um, tornado survival. Oh, well, I guess three. I'm tr I'm telling you, tornado wars is gonna start. It's gonna start next weekend. I promise you, promise you, promise you. Maybe <laughs> there's still a lot of preparation I gotta do. And of course, maybe a movie that would come along maybe next year. A lot of preparation would have to go into that too. I'm not gonna make any promises. Making promises is bad because it's hard to keep promises. Learn that in life, children. Even though I'm only 16 and I'm trying to lecture you on stuff like that. <laughs> so yeah. Um, oh wow. We've been going for longer than I thought. Screw you. Speed limit. Oh we should have pulled off and parked there. Alright the next rest stop. We will. We will stop. We will end off the recording. I will sign out. I will say bye to you all. And then that will be it. So yeah. Um, tornado Wars. Be patient. We will send you all emails. Check your email account this week. Um, we need to do team selection this week. I will try and get their butts into a call and say, Hey, focus. We got to get this thing started. If we want to, like, successfully do this. We're just slowing things down here. Um, but, yeah. I'm going to get their butts in a call this week. We're going to pick teams and all that. We'll be ready to go. Um, I hope it starts this weekend. I'm not going to make a promise on it. Because there's no telling with these guys. They're the most inconsistent people I've ever worked with. Or played with. Or Like, hey, I'll be on tomorrow night. Really? Okay, cool. I'll be there for with you. Next day. Hey, I'm busy. Hey, I'm busy too. What do you know? Oh, wow. Not surprising. <laughs> happens all the time it just happens in general with youtube if you do youtube you would know that like nothing goes according to plan at all <laughs> and, and i mean at all and we're getting this lane dang why is the speed limit so slow through here 
Just a small little curve. I'm no, I gotta stay in this lane. Sorry, dude, if there's anyone behind me. <laughs> um, loads. Hey, I was gonna stop in loads. So that'll work out fantastic. But yeah, YouTube can be really inconsistent. Um, you know. So these videos are looking like they'll be about 20 minutes long each episode. Um, I'm gonna pull off to the side in loads. Lods or loads? Who knows? There's so many points and slashes in that name that, holy cow. Oh, wrong one. We're gonna back her down here. Actually, we're gonna hit M. We're gonna set a destination, a little side place to go. There we go. End it with a lagging ending. Oh, hit the brakes. Put on the parking brake. I know, I've got space in between, but we gotta take off on a hill here, so that's gonna be rough. I'm trying not to kill it here. Okay. Oh, grab it, grab it. Ah, yes, we did it. That was a challenge. <laughs> Taking off on hills is the worst in this game. Cause you got oh, I'm going. Screw you, light. <sighs> hey, truck. <laughs> I'm gonna cut over a little bit. I know. Will going wild. I'm trying not to wreck it. So we only got one percent damage through that, through that little run there. Um, good job by me, a skilled driver, probably. I gotta go study for my permit now. Oh, right turn. And then we're gonna turn right here to end off the video. Uh, let's see. Park right over here. So, yeah, um, uh, thank you all for watching. All right, so thank. I'll get better. Thank you all for watching this episode or video of Euro Truck Simulator 2, pulling some logs with the Kenworth W900. Um, it went well. Uh, I was hoping the things would drop down whenever you parked it, but they didn't. It just kind of stands there on its own. Oh no, it does. That's cool. Um, but yeah, thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy. Give me a suggestion for what to pull, what truck to use. Anything American. I ain't doing no European crap. Um, but yeah, that's gonna do it for this episode. Leave your comments on anything I said. I don't care. Um, I'll try to get back to you on any of them. And I will see you all later. Dang it. Bye!